24 hours a day, 7 days a week, you're listening to the world's smoothest jazz radio station, RippedRadio.com. It's Fredericksburg, Virginia's number one smooth jazz station. Ripped Radio. Smooth Jazz, W-R-I-P. It's smooth 24 hours a day at RippedRadio.com. Smoothing out the edges of your day 24-7 at RippedRadio.com. Hello everyone, Ronnie J here, and uh, in this video I'm going to talk about where you can get jingles, station IDs, and commercials made. In other words, radio imaging. So rather than walk you through all the websites that you can go and where you can get uh, these things made, I created an article on the Internet to Radio Station website. If you visit the website and uh, you scroll down on the recent articles, you'll see a blog article here written, Radio Imaging. Uh, if you should access the website at some later date where I've added uh, more content and this gets pushed down to the bottom of the barrel, so to speak, then all you have to do is uh, come up to the top and um, there's a search button here. Just enter in Radio Imaging and you should find that article. Radio Imaging. All right, so once you get to the Oracle, let's open it up and uh, everything is, is explained there for you. I've uh, explained uh, all the uh, common terminology associated with uh, radio imaging. What is radio imaging? Why is radio imaging important? Types of radio imaging? And um, where do you get? Radio imaging. I left some of my resources here. Uh, these are all very good resources, very professional. Uh, you heard in the beginning of uh, this video uh, several jingles that I had made, and the lady who made those images, uh, her name is uh, Mary uh, Copland. She's with uh, Bella Vox. She's very good. I've had a few done with uh, Music Radio Creative. They are very good as well. If you want male voiceovers and jingles and commercials made. Let's say, for example, if you had some local businesses reach out to you and uh, they want to advertise on your radio station. They want, say, a 15-second, 20-second uh, commercial, but they don't know where to get started. Well, here you go. All you have to do is uh, visit one of these uh, resources here. And, of course, the, business that, uh, reached, the businesses that reached out to you would have to provide the... Uh, the text as to what they want to say uh, want you to have said in those commercials or what they want to have said in those commercials and jingles or you can offer suggestions if you if you would like I do that on occasion I have done that on occasion and uh, then uh, before you quote them a price you would contact um, these resources to see what's going to cost you to have that done for them then, of course, what they'll do here, they'll send you a sample before charging you any money. And then if you uh, you let the, the business or businesses listen to the commercial, if they approve it, then um, I highly recommend that you get payment up front from them. And also, along the way, you want to set up a structure as to how often they want their ads ran in your playlist or within your rotation on your radio station, you know, once per hour, uh, three times a day or whatever, and you charge them accordingly. And that's something that you have to work out because it's going to depend upon how many listeners you have to your station. The more listeners you have to your station, the more money you can command. Uh, don't get crazy with it. Uh, you want to be fair and reasonable. You don't want to lose money and uh, you want this to be a win-win situation. And so there's a delicate balance to be played here. And I talk about those things in, uh, I believe, one of the last videos that I'm going to be uh, doing in this series as far as getting sponsors. 
Okay, so that's basically it. Visit the website, internetradiostation.com, and look for the article entitled Radio Imaging. This is Ronnie J. Thank you for listening.